Hey YouTube, how's it going? Uh, welcome back to Phantom Chaser. Uh, today we're gonna go over some pointers, maybe a slightly updated guide. Uh, just some recommendations that I have for playing this game right now. So, um, I don't know if you guys have been playing this game for a while, or if you're new, if you're new, um... First, I want to talk about star stones. Um, right now, don't use them for summoning. Um, use them only for stamina refreshes. Or uh, try not to use them for filling up your gold either, if you can help it. Try to earn that properly. Um, if you want to add some more inventory spaces, that's probably okay. Use a few of those for that when you run out of inventory spaces. Uh, that's definitely something that you probably are going to need to do eventually anyways. But definitely don't use them for summoning right now. At least for right now until it, the developers get a little farther along with this game. Because it, it needs a lot of work yet. That brings me to my next point. Don't go crazy buying packages either, or spending money on star stones too much. Uh, with this point in the game, I don't recommend that. Uh, you want to buy some smaller packages, uh, go ahead. Um, but definitely, I, I don't really recommend spending a crap ton of money on this game right now, the way it is right now. It needs, it needs some development first. Let's go pick up our stuff. We got stuff. Let's pick it up. Yay. Come on. Hey, stamina stuff. Give me something. Let's do that. Yeah, crap. Junk. Stones. Um, blue. Like the honor. It looks like I got some stamina to spend. Yay. Does the weekly start over again? Okay, good. Sweet. Okie dokie, friends. Let's see this. Friends, friends, friends. Somebody's working your friends. No honor to send. Yeah, I think I already replaced everybody I can too, so I'm not going to do any more of that. Always remember to go through your friends list and look for people that don't log in anymore and delete them and replace them with other people if you can remember to. You can do up to five a day, so I definitely recommend doing that. Well, let's just go over here a quick second. So, chaser pack, definitely worth it. It's only 99 cents anyways. If you want to buy a package, buy, buy that and buy these. These are all fine. They're all definitely worth it. Joy growth pack is a bit more expensive. And, oh God, I don't even remember. It was like 20 or 30 bucks, I, I think. But, um... Yeah, that one was definitely worth it, because you get lots of stuff. I haven't even finished collecting everything. But, I've seen some other packages that were not worth it, like the Black Friday stuff was not worth it. Uh, and then, you want to spend as much time leveling up as you can. Let's see here. Well, I'll level... Anybody over here? Anybody? Mm -hmm. Not really. Not really. Oh, maybe Blaze. Is that our, that one? Yeah, there we go. Yay. 
I don't think I have any more to transcend him, though. Pretty sure I do not. any of these people, I'm pretty sure I can't do any transcending. So, uh, anyway, so the next thing that I would like to talk about is leveling up, upgrading, transcending, and evolution. So, let's just go manage team a quick second. I do, I have done one evolution. I have another one where I'm getting sit, kind of sitting on right now. So, Lulu is ready for evolution. Okay. I, I can do it, but I have not yet. I'm just leaving her at level 200 for right now. So, let's see. I don't know. Let, let's compare her stats to the one that I've already done. So, her stats at level 200 are 34,000 attack, 15,000 hit points, and 3,000 defense. Just as an example. Okay, 34... 15 and 3 for those stats. Now let's go find Murray. Where's Murray? Why do I have a filter on? Maybe I have a filter on. Yeah, I do. I was like, what the hell is over there? Okay, so Marie has been evolved. She was at 200, and then I evolved her up to a 5-star. And then, because she, and then, um, I leveled her back up to level 100. I can't go past that right now, because you need other of her as a 5-star to do that, and that's hard to do. But, okay, so, 36... 15 and 5. So she has a little bit better, a little bit better stats this way. So I, I, I guess I could do that with uh, Lulu. I just haven't gotten around to it yet, I guess. Um, so you can do that, but just keep in mind that once you evolve somebody up to a 5 star, it's definitely more difficult to transcend them at level 100 because you have to have other of them also evolved up to a five star to be able to do that and it's crazy hard see like I, I have two other Marie's but they're only three stars and I can't use them to transcend her yeah, I'm sure I don't have anybody to transcend too bad though. I guess I'll do this evolution. Oh, I gotta go get more blue spirit fires. I forget about that. Well, yeah, let's go do that right now. Boom, boom. Yeah, that's enough. Let's see, blue, I need a bad green team. Yeah, that's another thing I recommend doing is go spend a few little bit of time and make yourself a few different teams. At least one of each color and then an arena team and a river of fire team. Um, it just makes it much easier for selecting teams. Yes, just go. I have plenty of stamina now. So, um... Oh, yeah, yeah. Back to Star Stones. What I was talking about earlier. So, the reason I currently don't recommend spending Star Stones on summoning is because they're hard to get. Um, and they're, they haven't put enough ways into this game to get them. Uh... At least that I can tell. Or it's too difficult to get them. There seems to be a finite number of star stones available. At this point. Except for buying them. Which means that the uh, 
the game developers a little bit on the greedy side. They're going to have to tone that back or make it a way so you can at least earn them slowly by completing some missions or something. Uh, until they do that, um, just be careful about how you spend your star stones. And stamina refresh, this is the best way to do it. Um, what else? Uh, arena. Good luck in Arena. It is insanely difficult. Like, seriously. Insanely difficult. Oh, that was easy. I got one already. Now we'll go do the evolution. Yay, she gets a slightly better outfit too. Although I can't really tell much difference. See, that always kills me too. When you first evolve her, the stats are screwed up and they're not actually accurate. There we go, upgrade her. Uh, what else? So, um, four stars are obviously better than three star monsters. I mean, you know, obviously. But the problem is, is it's really difficult to get enough of them. So that you can uh, transcend, because once you hit level 100... Then you have to, um, you have to have other of those characters to do transcendence, basically. And my phone just crashed. Damn it. So annoying. Stop crashing. Don't, no crashy. No crashy, crashy. Did I turn the sound down? You guys want to hear the music? Okay, oh, so once you hit level 100, then the only way you can increase instead of upgrading is by doing transcendence. And then you have to either have a shaman of transcendence with the appropriate number of stars. And the four star shaman of transcendence are pretty rare. And I have never seen a 5 star, so I don't even know if they exist. And, it's always like this, ever it crashes, it's really slow. And so, basically, you other option is to have more of that same person. So, in order to transcend your 4 star monster, you have to have another one exactly like that. So it's almost not even worth leveling them up until you have like 5 of them. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I don't care about mission rewards right now. I'm trying to finish a little more, uh, upgrading Lulu. It's so weird. It seems like her stats are higher. Whatever, level it up. 
We'll go look at it after it's done. Trying to hit. One more upgrade. Trying to get low on cash because it's expensive. And I don't know, I don't got much to level her up with left anymore. Pretty sure I'm, like, screwed at this point. Ladies in. I have some red ones. Oh, that'll work. There now, so she's at level 100, so I can't do her up any more higher either. Um, where is she? Yeah, exactly. Oops, that's right, I was gonna do manage team to look at her stats. Oh yeah, her stats are a little bit better actually. 43,000 attack, 17,000 hit points. My face is in the way. Yeah, so that's good, you know. It's kind of hard to complain about that. She'll be a decent person to have around. I wonder how she compares to me. Yeah, Ming's slightly better. Ming is, uh, somebody they gave us from an event. What else should I do? What else should I do? I know. I haven't done my tower today. We can, let's do the tower. All right, let's see. Uh, I guess the green team is strong. Let's take a character with us and make sure we don't lose. How about the friends anyway? These load times kill me. I should edit that crap out. He's not the guy I tapped on. Why did you fight somebody else? Well, the game, like, recommends you hardcore to, like, tap on a monster so your team will focus fire them, and then you do that, and then they focus fire somebody else. Like, what the fuck? What the heck? Yeah. 
Isn't that good? We're losing. Wow. She's a problem? Yeah, she's the problem. That's a brutal team there. Yeah, the, the that's nasty. Hmm. Wow, we lost. I I can't do any leveling up or anything. It's the first time I ever lost a tower like that. I didn't want to give me a god damn it. I didn't want to transcend. Oh, what machine crap do we got? Gold. I can't believe I lost a tower like that. Yeah, why did they click that mess? Let's go back to the tower here. Let's try that again. Let's see here. Whose skills can we bring? Let's go manage team. What do we do for our back row people here? Put Lulu back here. Um, put that black lane in the front. Put man in the back. Just give us better skills to use. And then who do we want to take with us? Who are we taking with us? Dragon. Oh. Let's take her. The heck did somebody get somebody up to level 340? Oh my god. 340? Somebody spent a lot of money on that crap. My god. Glad they're my friend. <laughs> my face. How the hell did a level 340 There's just way too much healing going on. I can't even do anything fast enough. I don't even get it. Like, why is there so much healing going on? The hell?
the hell? Like, why? I don't get it. I'm so confused. My Lulu can't, like, consistently, can't constantly heal like that. It's ridiculous. What the hell? It's the same one! What? What the hell happened? That was weird. Well, I'm just gonna wait and not use them until we're at the boss this time. I can't believe I'm having this much trouble with the tower, it's so weird. Let's turn off auto skill for a minute until we get to the boss, because I don't think we want... Okay. Why? Why? I, I'm so confused. Finally, jeez, it was brutal. Memory of Baba Yaga. Times five? Are you freaking serious? Well then, that's nice. I'll take that. Do I have a Baba Yaga? Oh, if I do not. Uh oh. Power is getting low. We are getting low in the power. The power. She's getting low. I think I'm just gonna stop for right now. Because we are gonna go. Back and find out about Baba Yaga. Can I craft her now? I, I'm sure I don't have enough.
definitely not to do it five times. Okay, so she's blue. And it's going to take all of my money to do this just once. If I do this again, it's going to make me do star stones. And I know I just told you guys not to do this, but I did it anyways. Yeah, I just get, I got to go earn more money. Yeah, I guess me two of them. Hmm. I don't really know much about her. I should go read. Let's go see her stuff. Where she done did go? Where, where, where is she? Long range control. Because she's blue, so like everything is long range and blue. Yeah, she's ugly, that's for sure. That's in the world. One bite. Sucks in the enemy and has 20% chance to swallow. <laughs> Gross! Gross! <laughs> Spits out an enemy that was not swallowed and deals 170 attack. Oh, she can't swallow the boss. Too bad. Attacks all enemies. Attack. This is. Intelligence by 580 and increases regain by one. Special seasoning. Dude, she's she's a, a walking like cliche. All attacks all enemies in front for 210 of attack or 20 seconds and seasons them. <laughs> Season leaves the mark. Swallows swallowing a seasoned enemy. With one bite gives a random buff. What? <laughs> really? Increases magic resistance of the entire party by 90 and applies random buff. Gained from swallowing a seasoned enemy to all allies. Okay. Whatever you guys are saying. I can make one more the way it is right now. Alright, well anyways, I think that's enough for you guys. You're probably going to get bored of this.